Now let's see if I can explain this properly. What they used to do is at the light fixtures, like up in the ceiling, they would run power to the light fixture. Let's say this is a light fixture in the ceiling. They would run their power to here. Then they would take another set of wires and go down to the light switch. So one wire was a hot wire that went down and fed the light switch. And then when you turn the light switch on, one was a hot wire that came back up to the light fixture. Okay. Well, that's how we're going to have to kind of do this. I don't, I don't usually wire that way. I usually always take the power to the light switch first, then go up to the light fixture. It's way easier for me to remember all the wires and stuff because black, you always have two black wires hooking up light switches, standard, standard single pole light switches, okay? And that's what we're doing here. But in this case, we're going to end up making this white wire that goes to the light switch. We're going to make this a hot wire. It's not going to be a white wire. So what do we have to do here? You know what? Got, I got it. Uh, God about that. I'm glad I brought it up here. We're going to have to ultimately make this a black wire. Okay. So what I'm going to do, and you always need to do this, I'm going to wrap black tape around this. And I should probably strip it off first. I'm take my wire strippers. I'm going to strip just the end off for a wire nut. Okay. And I'm going to wrap this. Now they have isolation tape. This is kind of like that. Um, it just tells somebody that if they ever get up into this junction box and they see this white wire connected to a black wire, they'll know why okay because we're acting as though this is a black wire all right so what happens is we've got our black power wire well let's do it a different way so we don't get all mixed up here okay here's my white wire now we're down to two white wires in this box right Let's just talk about that for a minute, okay? Here's our main white, white wire that comes into the box that helps feed this with power. Here's the white wire that goes down to the first light fixture, okay? We're going to need to connect those two together, so let's do that next, okay? I'm going to... We're just going to... That's probably about long enough. I guess I can cut that one a little shorter. Okay, something like that. And now I've got to strip that back. And these, and these older wires give you fits sometimes because they're hard to strip off because they're so old like this wire right here is over 50 years old and the plastic has a tendency to want to bond onto the copper here's my new wire watch how easy this one slides right off boom okay so simple enough white to white here we're going to hold these two up together like that if you have to you can kind of bend bend it into place hold it get your yellow wire nut I'm gonna put that on there okay so far so good follow me now you might be wondering what the heck is gonna happen with all these other wires these black wires okay now I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna fold it I don't want to just fold it once because it's too long and then I'd have to shove it in like that and get it all messed up just grab take your finger right there and fold it over I can put my finger kind of down in there and kind of help bend it and fold that one into the box. Bye-bye. Just like that. Okay. Now we're down to these black wires. You might, you might be thinking, oh yeah, just put all the black wires together. We're not going to do that. And here's, 
here's what we're going to do. 